morning. I'm ready for my celery juice. I drank my 32 ounces of lemon water. And what I decided I might do is make that the night before so that when I wake up, I can just drink my lemon water. Um, it's just one step that might just be easier for me. It's just a thought for you. So I've done my celery juice and what I wanted to show you this morning, because today is very similar to yesterday, um, I thought I would show you. When you cut your celery, what you need to do is you need to keep the celery. So what you do is you take off all the outside edges because you don't need them. And what I am showing you this for is because you can grow your own celery. It's really super cool, but you don't need all these outside edges. So you take all them off and I'll put that into the compost. And what you do is you sit it into a container of water and these ones here, I shall show you. These ones here are my babies. I call them my babies because I've been growing them for a few days now. And so what I'm preparing for is if there is a total celery mania, I always have my own celery. So I'm growing it. This one here is particularly awesome. Growing its own little babies. And some are a little bit smaller than others, but they'll grow. So I've got them sitting in the water. And so every celery that I cut open, I do this to and I keep. And so that's probably, uh, for me, it's a great tip that I heard about that I'm doing. So after I've had my celery juice, I'm going to um, prepare some more juice for later on in the day because I've got a fairly busy day and that way I know I'll at least be getting all my veggies if I get too busy and preoccupied and I'm going to make a dragon fruit smoothie for my breakfast I really enjoy them and they satisfy me so that's what I'm going to have for my breakfast and then I'm going to think about what I'm going to plan for the rest of the day but I think I've already decided that I'm going to uh, make sweet potato fries tonight with medical mediums tomato sauce. So I will give you the recipe later on in the day when I get to that part and I'll show you how it turns out. So I'm excited, I'm really looking forward to it. All the food is fun, filling, and I'm feeling great. I had an awesome sleep. But for now, I'm completely happy with no fats. So the transition for me has been really easy. If it's not easy for you, then make sure you follow the medical medium suggestion of just, if you've been doing fats, cut it back by 50%. For me, I can't cut it back because there's nothing to cut back. So anyway, I'm gonna continue on and make more juice for my lunch. And then I think I'm going to pre-prepare some apple and date sauce because I really enjoyed that make my smoothie and then onwards and upwards. Doing preparation in the morning makes it easier because as I said, today is a bit of a busy day and I don't want to neglect me because it's all about me. It's all about me and my liver and our relationship. So have an awesome day, whatever you're doing. And if you're following along with me, I'm with you all the way. With the celery juice after you've made it, it's a good idea to run it through a strainer to make sure that you don't have any fiber in there because I don't have a lot left over there but I think it's totally worth doing it because the whole idea of drinking the medical medium juice is that it's easy for the body to assimilate. There's no dry digestion occurring so it's just going straight in. That's why it's so beneficial. So once you've made it just get a little tea strainer and do what I did and make it easy on your body. That's the whole purpose of what we're doing here. Because I'm doing preparation for the day, um, day two, you're supposed to have one apple in the morning and two in the afternoon. And I, uh, because of my retainer, I don't easily eat apples, so I'm gonna prepare the apples. So what I've done is I've already cored the apples and I'm going to plop them into my wonderful Breville food processor and I'm going to add five pitted 
medjool organic dates, some juice of a lemon. This is the one thing, when you're buying all organic, sometimes things go a little bit old too quickly. And I had a lemon that was definitely going a little old, so I thought, okay, chop off the bad bit, and I'll use the lemon juice for my apple. And then a quarter of a teaspoon of cinnamon, and I'm going to make my apple sauce. I feel like I'm preparing for my baby, <laughs> but I really enjoy this. So it's going to be a nice, easy snack, and I'm going to have it prepared, and I'll have it in a container ready. And ready. Okay, so the apple sauce is ready for my snacks later on in the day. Another reason why I decided to do all of today's in one go was because for starters, it just gets it all made in one hit. But only two apples in the food processor, and it really was having a struggle to actually make it into a nice, soft um, consistency. And so now, I'm gonna pour it into my little jar, and I've got my snack for the morning and for the afternoon, all ready to rock and roll. So if I did feel hungry, There'd be no reason for me to get hangry. I would just grab my apple sauce. So I am seriously prepared now. I have my delicious, wonderful smoothie, which is more like dessert. Is, could this really be so good for you? Mmm, pitaya, bananas, and blueberries. Mmm, in the meantime, I've got my prepared apple sauce for mid-morning. I've got ready-made in my thermos a hibiscus tea. And in this thermos, I've got some juice for lunch, which can go with whatever else I decide to have for lunch. So I'm really under control and feeling really good. And now I'm gonna have my, they call it breakfast. I call it dessert. It's so I decided I'm going to make the liver rescue broth for dinner tonight. It was so handy having the apple sauce. I did go out and preparing the food to have it with me was so awesome. And now I'm preparing the, um, the broth, medical mediums liver healing broth. So I'm just putting in the grated ginger and turmeric. And my husband's probably coming in because he can smell good things cooking in the kitchen. He's enjoying the rewards of all my cooking. And then, are you enjoying? Are you enjoying all the food, husband? I'm absolutely loving it. He's loving it. That's a good sign. And if he's naughty, I'll hit him with my burdock. Is it that soup? This is the, the different one. This oh, is really? the liver rescue broth. The amazing thing about it is it takes away your appetite and you feel full. That's very so I don't true. eat too much. I love it. That's Thanks. true. And this, so this is burdock root. I have never seen it before, but I went looking for it because it's in the liver rescue broth, and I have to chop up a cup. So this is look what it looks like before you peel it, and here it is when it's ready to be chopped up. So all I have to do is that, and I've put everything else together. I've got to add the cilantro, some garlic, and some water, and then I'm going to let it brew this afternoon. And then with this, I'm going to make the medical medium um, potatoes, uh, roasted potatoes, like fries, with his homemade tomato sauce. Sounds yummy to me. It's hard to believe I'm actually doing a detox. Oh, the soup is looking good. It's been probably almost an hour and it's looking really lovely. Medical medium says one to four hours. So um, I'm going to, I think I might just turn it off and just let it sit there and get really delicious because it's still a couple of hours until dinner. And then meantime, all I have to do is chop up the potatoes. My sauce is made and we'll have soup with potato fries and tomato sauce. Well, it's time my sweet potato fries go into the oven. I put a tiny amount of coconut oil on and a little bit of garlic and onion spice blend. And there's my tomato sauce just waiting for the potato chips to be ready in about half an hour. So they're about to go into the oven. Dinner is ready. Day two. 
So we've got the liver detox soup, the homemade tomato sauce, and the sweet potato fries. And I'm looking forward to it. And I'm feeling great. Beautiful. Sweet potato french fries and soup. A nice simple dinner. Thank you, honey.